The Girl Guides Association recognized the fine efforts of its girls to take better care of the environment at a ceremony marking the close of its ICAS-funded Community Climate Change Project. The project, which began in August 2016, saw the girls from around the island develop and implement exciting projects within their own schools that encourage students to reduce, reuse, and recycle waste. Projects included recycling of plastic bottles and other waste materials to produce products, creating composting sites, and installing more bins at schools. The project was carried out in three phases. First phase of the project focused on sensitizing students and to the environment and the climate change through training. The second phase focused on implementing the activities that were planned. Today, we see phase three of the project recognizing the young women in expressing needs to protect the environment by reducing the amount of waste that enters our landfill at perseverance. The recycling and composting projects started by the students provide a model for other schools to adapt. We cannot continue to send unwanted waste to our landfills. And I wish to thank you for your approach to waste reduction through the implementation of the three hours, reduce, reuse, recycle, and the composting initiatives that you have been undertaking. I wish to commend the Grenada Girl Guides Association for taking this bold initiative to seek to educate our nation's children on how our actions on the environment, especially in proper waste disposal, is related to our climate change issues. Poor waste disposal habits contribute to the risk of public health problems and threatens the sectors that livelihoods depend on. About 45% of what is in our landfill should not be there. And these materials could be recycled and reused, adding to our soil structure and helping to save our marine environment. But if left in the, in the landfill, these materials could contribute to a, a large amount of greenhouse gases, which has a number of um, uh, environmental problems, as we know. The government of Grenada hopes to lead the way through policies that seek to protect the environment. Being mindful of the persistent and detrimental impacts of litter, particularly plastic and styrofoam in our environment. Government has appointed a sustainable waste management task force to look into measures to address the importation and sale of non-biodegradable products and to explore alternatives, biodegradable products, in an attempt to safeguard our environment. The Girl Guides Climate Change Project was one of three projects that targeted nationwide education and awareness, aimed at helping communities adapt to climate change. The ICAS project is part of the International Climate Change Initiative, funded by the German government, to assist Grenada to adapt to climate change.